Alright, stick it out. These are our two plates. Uh, we have 10 layers of denim with poly resin and a PE5 ceramic tile in front. And then we have seven layers of denim with poly resin and a PE5 ceramic tile plate in front. Anyways, let's get to testing. Alright, let's check it out. My bad. Alright, so check out the seven layer first. Whoa. Looks like we have a pass through. Doesn't look like it. No? Alright, guess not. No pass through. And then my fuck up right here. Well, no penetration on it. Even when you hit the side. <laughs> so it blew out the side. So Just didn't penetrate through. So I and hit then, there. Man, that was a bad shot. That's all right. So once again bulged through on this one. It looked like it ripped some of the denim, but uh, didn't pass through. Okay, we're gonna test this uh, 10 layer plate again. Kind of hit off in the upper left hand corner. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and try and see if it has multi-hit capability. Uh, we're gonna shoot for the bottom right. Let's get to testing. All right, check it out. I'm gonna pull that. Well, I hit it where I was supposed to. No pass through. No pass through. Wow, it's pretty incredible. So, pulled off to the side. See, so this is part of the jacket right there. Yeah, you can see part of the jacket in there. Okay, we have our two denim plates that we tested out. Uh, first one that we shot was the seven layer denim plate uh, entered in uh, just below center and then we uh, we saw a big bulge in back we thought it went through but uh, actually there's no penetration on this one it's just the bulging that caused the tape to rip and open it up and once we opened it up we found uh, most of the uh, kind of copper jacket pieces in there so uh anyways that's uh the seven layer denim plate and it uh 
definitely didn't compare to the uh, 10 layer denim plate. So the 10 layer denim plate we actually shot twice. We shot it up here and then the bullet uh, impacted and then shot up to the side. Then we shot it again um, lower down here and it actually took that one. You can see that there's uh, basically stripped the jacket off, stopped it clean, busted up all the lead fragments. So anyways, those are the two tests and as you can see there's no pass through on either one of those two shots. So I think uh, you know, I'm willing to say that uh, the 10 layer is probably the, the best bet to continue on with uh, full scale production. Thank you.